Good morning, guys. It's Bobby Joe. Don't mind my face. I got like makeup. I took a shower and I took it all off and everything. But yeah, it's the 22nd, and I figured that I would do my first injections with you for IVF. And I hope that you can hear me. Uh, I'll probably stand up and take the shot and on camera. But there's some fuzzy stuff on my floor. My dog ate, um, their stuffed animal. And so the stuffing's all over my floor and I haven't picked it up yet. I don't care. Okay, so, um, this, uh, is sodium chloride. It's nothing. It's just what you use to mix your injections with. And I, as you all know, I've already done this, um, once. And, uh, yeah, I thought I had some cloth wipes. Maybe I do. You know, to, uh, <laughs> to wipe my skin. I've already done it once, but I should do it again on camera, I guess. If I can find them. There's so much. I have so much crap for injections. Let me look. Got it. I call prep. Okay, so that wasn't hell on earth. My dogs always think they need to make an appearance, apparently. Okay, so back to this. You want to keep all this stuff sterile and not dirty. So, uh, this is, you just take your sodium chloride first and you this is a Q cap you put it on your syringe look at them nails okay so sodium chloride um just sits on there like this then you turn it upside down at my office we always use one mill so you pull it down doesn't matter I mean you can't mess it up. You can put 500 in it and you can put it right back out. So it's not like you can really mess it up. But you want to put it on the one. Here. Can you guys see the one at all? Yeah. There's the one. So that's where you want to put it. And it'll just pop off there. And you got to be careful because if you let it go, it's just going to go. So you got to hold on to it. Otherwise, it's going to have its own agenda and then you pop it off, it'll release that pressure. So you don't have to keep um, holding it after that to, to mix the other one. But um, the pressure with that on there is intense. So I'm gonna, it doesn't matter, I'm doing three Bravel and three Manipure. It doesn't matter which which medication that you start with. It don't matter at all. According to my office. So you have one milliliter. Uh, these are Bravel. They all look the same. They, mine come with a green um, cap. And um, yeah. So I'm going to take my one, I think it's milliliter, yeah milliliter, put it in my Bravel. So it just goes right down on that. And then see how it's turning into liquid and pushing the solution in there. Then you swirl. You never shake. You just kind of swirl it around. Okay. Then you take it back out. And it should still add up to just the one. The one. Okay, so I'm not going to show you the other ones um, in your face, but just do the same. Swirl it. I wonder what this Facebook is about to say. I just uploaded on Facebook that this is about to go down. So now my phone's starting. Justin just had to go to the doctor to sign more papers, and I didn't feel like going with him. So I didn't his day off. He doesn't have like um he doesn't have like a normal
schedule because his weekend is uh, um, sat um, Saturdays to to Saturday. His days all like his weekend is like uh, Sundays and Mondays. It's not um normal. So I'm doing my last rebel now. Okay, these are Minipure. Sun's starting to come out here. It's still early. Minipure. So you just pop this off like that. Like that. And this is what it looks like at the top. So I'm doing three and three, so I'm going to do this to all three of them. Keeping my one milliliter and Taking my last Ravel out. Okay, those are done. Now I'm going to do the Minipure. So it just goes on like this and down. Then that solid will turn to liquid. Yeah. Hello, son. Thanks for joining us. Okay, so it's probably mixed. Taking it back out. This one doesn't have as much pressure as the sodium chloride. I don't know why. Um, but it just doesn't. Okay. Same thing. Take it out. No matter how much medication that you put in here, it should always stay with one. It should always end up with one. So you got to make sure you're getting all of your, your juicy goodness out of there. My phone's going crazy because everyone knows I'm doing this right now. Awkward! No, it's really not awkward at all. I lied. I just lied about that. Okay. So I'm to make sure I mix this really well, really well. You can kind of see, like, if you if it's done mixing, because it kind of it doesn't look clear. It looks kind of um, gritty because you're they're solids and then they turn to and they turn. <clears throat> so I just like to check to make sure I didn't leave like mounds of fluid or anything in these and I did it. Give it one last swirl. Okay, take it out. Okay, so it should still equal the one. Okay, so take that off. Take off your Q cap. Open up your actual needle. <coughs> then this just screws on. This. Let me make sure this is actually on there. Pop it off carefully. Okay, so it's not huge, you know. Let me put it on my forehead so you can actually see. Not bad at all, right? Open your alcohol prep. <coughs> Got it. I'm going to stand up so you guys can see me. Ow. Good enough, right? Okay, so look at my huge pajamas. I sleep in stuff that is way too big for me because it's comfortable. And but you know, whatever, right? So let this dry. I don't want to be putting like you know stuff on my 
whatever. That would hurt. Okay. Make sure, take your needle, make sure that the medicine is at the top of your needle. Okay. And now inject yourself. Whew, okay, I'm done this in a minute. Let me see how I like to do this. I'm going to start on the right side. And here we go. You do not have to press really hard. It will go in. Okay, release the needle. Fucking hate that part. Okay, that burn. We're fine. Everyone made it. I'm alive. Now I gotta go clean up my stuff and we did it. See you guys next time.